What's up, guys? This is um, Alex's profile of his Evil Swarm. And uh, here we go. Alright, we run two Rabbit, because that's standard in Evil Swarms, along with the three Vanillas, three Heliotrope, just 1950 beater. Then we got three Caster. Caster is one of your main guys, just get additional normal summons. Can't be Baylord, which is nice. We got three Mandragora. It's a basic Cyber Dragon. They control more monsters. You can special summon it. You can also just normal summon it with your additional normal from Caster. Uh, three Thunderbird. It just wins you grind games. It's like a uh, wind up rabbit, except you have to chain it to something. Three Kirkion, because Kirkion is boss and best top deck. You top deck this late game and it could potentially be a win. And then that's it for the Evil Swarms and the Rabbits. And then we got the Bailers, because I like them the main. Under the spells, we got Triple Infestation Pandemic, because it's a blanket lance and you can search with Ophion. It's just the best card in the deck. I have two MSD for back row removal. Rota to search out Caster for your Caster plays. Heavy Storm, Dark Hole, and Monster Reborn, the Holy Trinity. Pretty self explanatory. On the traps, we got one Infestation Infection. It just gets you whatever Evil Swarm you need when you're in a tight situation. I main three Compulse because it's really good this meta, and I like Compulse. I main two Eradicators. I like it in the main. It's good against lots of things, including spell books. I mean, in the mirror match, if you call spells and hit hit their pandemics, that is really good, and it can win you the game. Uh, we run two X Y Z Reborn. One's a proxy, getting it soon. X Y Z Reborn's good because Ophion's in the grave. You can just bring it back out and then have to deal with it again. Then we have two Dark Illusion. I run this over Dress because the ruling on Dress is like if they may stroke it, and they're already targeted, and you chain Dress. Since targeting already occurred, May Stroke's effect will already go through, or whatever effect targeted will already go through. This negates, it's a counter trap, so if they target Dark Monster, you can negate and destroy it. So that's why I run it over Dress. Then we have the Solemn Duo, pretty self explanatory. Onto the extra deck, we run Triple Ophion, because Ophion is Ophion. He's the MVP of the deck, searches your infestation cards, and wins you games. We have Double Bahamut. Good in the mirror match, you can steal Ophion's. Good against lots of people, actually. Uh, you only need two, though. One Ouroboros. It's good at one, it's just good for certain situations. And, yeah. Thanatos, it's coming out for Cataster. Crazy Box, in case you don't want to use Eradicator on your Ophion. Like, if you don't have XYZ reborn. Pearl, for the mirror match. Utopia, Shockmaster. King of Feral Imps, this is for your Vasky in the side. The Butterfly, and Maestro Oak, and Cowboy. Pretty standard. On to the side, we have Reptilian Vasky. This is for dragons. You side this in against dragons, get rid of their tokens, special summon this, and you can destroy the Draco Sackwitz effect. Then we have Electric Virus for dragons and machines if I ever face them. Two Max C for the meta, pretty much. Third MST. Double Soul Taker, because Soul Taker's pretty good. Third, oh, Mind Drain for dragons in water. Third Eradicator. Third Dark Illusion. Double goes a match for rogue decks. And then we have triple Imperial Iron Wall for dragons, prophecies, and various other things. Alright, thanks Alex. Uh, this is Team Sandwich signing out. Comment, rate, and subscribe.